For this problem, we want to use transformations and the graph of f of x equals 2 to the x to graph g of x equals negative 2 to the x plus 3. g of x is equal to negative f of x plus 3. The negative function means that we'll be reflecting the graph across the x-axis. So our new points are at 1, negative 2, and 2, negative 4. Connecting these points gets the graph of negative f of x. Adding 3 to x means that we will shift this new graph 3 units to the left. So our new points are at negative 2, negative 2, and negative 1, negative 4. Connecting these points gets the graph of g of x. This is the final answer.